You have been assigned to a mission few would qualify for. A mission few would survive. You are about to embark upon a great crusade. The eyes of the world are upon you. The hopes and prayers of liberty-loving people everywhere march with you. At the turning point of World War II, across a 50-mile stretch of France's Normandy coast, the Allies staged a massive assault against Hitler's vaunted Atlantic Wall. Valor. Duty. Leadership. Sacrifice. Can one man truly make a difference? Lieutenant Powell, I'm Colonel Hargrove from the Office of Strategic Services, the OSS. Our branch specializes in covert operations, usually deep behind enemy lines. Espionage, sabotage, infiltration. That's the business we're in, Lieutenant. As you know, Germany's famed Africa Corps has captured key locations along the southern coast of the Mediterranean and is now digging in. Our response, in coordination with our British allies, is an invasion of North Africa. The attack is codenamed Operation Torch. This is it, Lieutenant. Our first large-scale offensive of the war. While everything you hear in this room is classified top secret, what I'm about to tell you is extremely sensitive and only known by a select few. The Germans have positioned artillery batteries along the coast, several of which overlook our intended landing zone. A British SAS operative has penetrated enemy lines of the town of Arzu on the Algerian coast. His mission was to sabotage these batteries, then give the all-clear signal to start the invasion. Yesterday, however, all contact with that agent was lost. The enemy's artillery positions remain intact, and the SAS officer's capture could compromise the entire operation. You and a small squad of your fellow rangers will infiltrate our zoo under cover of darkness. Your goal is to destroy the coastal batteries and rescue the captured agent. You'll receive specific details of the mission once you're in the field. The SAS operative is Major Jack Grillo, a man I've known for years. He would never allow himself to give up what he knows to the Germans, so please find him before he's forced into taking drastic measures. No doubt about it, this is a critical mission, Lieutenant. Your team has trained hard, and I have every confidence you'll get the job done. Good luck. Germans 
checkpoint, 200 yards. Okay, squad, listen up. This is a rescue mission, so watch your fire. And don't give your position away. Advance some cover and check the corners. Everyone keep quiet. Was haben Sie geladen? He's taking too long. He's buying it. Ihr Ausweis ist ungültig. Zeigen Sie mir bitte Ihre Papiere. Danke sehr. Zeigen Sie sofort Ihren Führerschein vor. He's not taking them, Captain. the door. What was that? I think I heard something. Ambush!
Thanks. They would have killed me for certain. Stick close to me at all times. Let's get going, Lieutenant. There they are! Fire! The documents and explosives I had were confiscated. We've got to recover them, or this mission is lost. They're probably in the Commandant's office. Shooting the spotlights will get their attention. It's best to just avoid them. Stick close, Lieutenant, and I'll show you how to avoid detection. Look alive! the documents. Now let's get the explosives. You know exactly what you want to know. So when you tell us, it's the easiest thing. Here they are. Let's 
go. Saved my life, sir. to blow that gate and set a charge. to destroy these flak 88s i'll take care of this one you get the other yafka core motor pool is up ahead use the rest of the explosives and sabotage as much as you can in the meantime, I'll get some transportation for us. Good luck, Lieutenant. I'll see you soon.
on the outskirts of the airfield. Remember, don't just take out the planes, we also want to get the fuel dump and any troops on the ground. And don't let any of those planes take off! Pal, we've got a truck out! their attention.
Let's split up. I'll draw their reinforcements away. Go through that bunker to the lighthouse. I'll meet up with you there.
Get in the back of the truck! <laughs> 